I suppose it was natural that I should develop an interest in ghosts and all things supernatural from an early age, as I spent my childhood in two archaic haunted houses in a remote part of the English countryside, where I would play for days on my own in the parklands with only my imagination as a friend. Both my father and elder brother were avid readers of ghost stories, and I inherited the family's library on the genre. My favorites were Arthur Mackin and M.R. James, mainly for their emphasis on mysteries as old as time itself, but also for the subtlety of their narrative. In later years, I discovered the works of Edgar Allan Poe, whose eerie tales of decaying Gothic mansions and dark crypts seemed to mirror my own obsession with the ghost that haunted them. On my 21st birthday, my father, who was himself a keen photographer, gave me an old Leica camera and I instantly became hooked on photography. What intrigued me most was the magic of time and light and the enigma of reality that these elements conjured up. Over the years, I've tried to portray this theme in my photographs, to inspire the viewer not to take everything around them at face value. to show that what we are conditioned to believe is reality may not be quite all that it seems. If only we take the time to inquire.